Hey there, viewers. We don't want to sound like alarmists or make you put your doctor on the speed dial, but we often ignore minor health-related warning signs, which turn into bigger issues later down the road. That headache you get every other afternoon? Let's not ignore it. Better safe than sorry. In today's video, we'll be discussing 35 symptoms that warrant a call to your doctor immediately. What are floaters? Can they be a big issue? What about unexplained eye pain or intense shoulder pain? We'll talk about all of these and more. Number one, floaters. Floaters appear in your vision and are usually a minor issue. However, they could also signal something more serious, such as a retinal detachment, a retinal tear, or inflammation in the eye. If not treated immediately, it may result in permanent loss of vision. Do you see floaters often? Have you ever wondered what they are? Share your experiences with the Bestie community in the comments below. Number two, high fever. Although a fever usually goes away, a high one can be a sign of more serious things to come. It's important you contact your doctor as soon as you can to rule out things like bacterial infection and pneumonia. Number three, unexplained eye pain. If your eye starts to hurt for no obvious reason, it could be a sign of conjunctivitis. If that's the case, you will need to medicate immediately. Even if it's not conjunctivitis, it could be a sign of a serious complication. Number four, shortness of breath. Shortness of breath is common when you've done a workout or gone through a strenuous activity, but if you haven't done anything, it could be a sign of heart-related issues. Number five, blurry vision. When your vision becomes blurry out of the blue, it's more than likely you're suffering from chronic issues such as diabetes and hypertension. It could also be a case of high cholesterol levels. Blurred vision could also point towards multiple sclerosis. Looking for answers on all the latest health and wellness news? Hit that subscribe button and join our millions of followers. Stay up to date on all our great bestie content. Number six, intense shoulder pain. If you're feeling intense pain in either of your shoulders, you might be experiencing a heart attack. This is especially true if the pain has come suddenly or has increased very quickly. Number seven, contacts and red watery eyes. If you're someone who wears contact lenses, you're at a greater risk of suffering an eye infection. This is especially true if you're not thoroughly cleaning your lenses. So if your eyes seem too watery or are red and painful, it's best to get them checked with a doctor immediately. Number eight, chest pressure. If you feel pressure on your chest, it could be another sign of a heart attack or maybe pneumonia. It can also indicate a pulmonary embolism. It's necessary to check every issue with your heart. Even if it turns out to be nothing, it's better safe than sorry. Number nine, double vision. Having double vision every now and then, especially when you're very tired, is normal. But if it's come out of the blue and doesn't seem to go away unless you close your eyes, a trip to the doctor is mandatory. This could be a sign of high blood pressure or even a stroke. Number 10, chest tightness. Just like with chest pressure, even a bit of tightness could point to the same issues. You will need to see a doctor and tell them about all the symptoms you're facing so they can make the right diagnosis. Number 11, weakness on one side. If you feel weak on only one side of your body, it could be an indication of a stroke. You need to see a doctor right away. Number 12, chest pain. One of the most common symptoms of a heart attack is chest pain. Although chest pain may be caused by acid reflux, it would be better if you get it checked by a doctor to be completely safe. Number 13, dizziness with chest pain. You could be dizzy for any number of reasons, but if you're feeling a pain in your chest at the same time, it could be a sign of heart disease. Number 14, leg or foot pain. If you feel a pain in your leg or foot that seems to be getting worse during the night, it could be a sign of a stress fracture. It will only get worse if you continue to walk on it without treatment. This pain could also be an indication of a blood clot. Number 15, throat pain starting from the chest. If you have throat pain, you would normally not give it much thought, as it could just be a sore throat. But if the pain first started in your chest and then moved up to your throat, it's a symptom of a heart-related issue. Number 16, rapid breathing. It's normal to breathe rapidly after a physical activity, but if it happens out of the blue, it could be the result of a blood clot in your lungs. There could also be an issue with your heart, or it could be an underlying condition like asthma. Number 17, breaking into a sweat. Sweating is also common after a physical activity. It can also happen when the environment you're in is particularly hot or if you have a fever. But if you break into a sweat for no apparent reason, it could be a sign of heart-related issues. Number 18, stiff neck and headache. 
When you suffer a stiff neck, it's probably because of a spasm in the muscles. But if you have a headache along with the stiffness, it could be because of a brain infection. This is especially true when you become very sensitive to light. Before we move ahead, here's another video you might like. Watch this video to learn more about the 11 foods people eat that can kill you. Now back to our list of symptoms that warrant a call to your doctor ASAP. Number 19. Swollen legs, feet, or ankles. If these areas seem to be swelling out of nowhere, it could be a symptom of congestive heart failure and liver disease. Cancer is also not out of the realm of possibility. Number 20. Burning yourself. When you burn yourself, whether it's due to working in a kitchen or playing with fire, it's hard to tell just how bad it is. On the surface, it could look harmless, when really, the opposite is true. It's best to get the burn checked by a doctor to be completely sure. Number 21. Skipping heartbeats. If your heart seems to be skipping a beat, and not just metaphorically, then it's a sign of a serious problem. It's best for your doctor to look at it so they can figure out what's causing this abnormal situation. Number 22. Lower right back pain. Pain in your lower right back could be a sign of appendicitis. This is usually the case if you haven't pulled a muscle. Number 23, flu. While the flu can be treated with medication, you need to take it seriously if you have underlying conditions. For instance, if you have diabetes, the flu can become very serious in your case. Number 24, vomiting for more than a day. Vomiting in and of itself is not a big concern, but if you've been vomiting frequently for more than a day, it could be a viral illness or food poisoning. Dehydration could be another reason as well. A change in electrolytes can also be a cause, which your doctor would want to treat immediately. Number 25, diarrhea for more than a day. Just as is the case with vomiting, suffering with diarrhea for more than a day could be a much more serious issue. Your potassium levels could drop significantly and cause other complications. Number 26, no urination for more than six hours. If you haven't had to pee for more than six hours, it's generally an indication of dehydration. But if you're having this problem despite drinking significant amounts of water, could be a sign of kidney failure. Number 27, racing pulse. Usually your pulse will go fast if you're anxious. You may also have an abnormality in your heart's rhythm. Either way, you'll need to get treatment as soon as possible. Number 28, hurts while swallowing. If you're having trouble swallowing even something as normal as your own spit, it's time to call the doctor. This condition is a warning sign of something more serious. Number 29, unable to breathe because of a cold. If you have a cold, you will generally face some discomfort with your breathing, but if it has become so serious that you're not even able to breathe properly, could be a symptom of pneumonia. Number 30, hurts when you pee. If it hurts when you're urinating, it's more or less a sign of a urinary tract infection. You could try to wait it out by drinking a lot of water, but it's best to see a doctor if the condition sticks around. Number 31, severe abdominal pain. If you have severe pain in your abdomen, it could be for any number of reasons. It could be a sign of appendicitis or because your bowels are being obstructed. Other conditions such as gallstones, hernias, and diverticulitis could also serve as reasons. Number 32, mood swings. If you're having mood changes for no particular reason, there are a wide variety of possibilities you should consider. It could be because of a mental health disorder or even diabetes that has not yet been diagnosed. You could even be showing signs of a stroke. Number 33, severe headache. If you have a severe headache, it could be because of bleeding in your brain. It's best to get it checked immediately and not look towards medication for relief. Number 34, passing out. If you've passed out for no particular reason, you shouldn't ignore it. This could be because of low glucose levels or low blood pressure. It could also be because of a heart condition or seizure. Number 35, unable to see out of one eye. If you're unable to see properly with one of your eyes, it could be because of a migraine. But if you've never had migraines, you should contact your doctor. It could be because of a stroke or a blockage in the blood vessels of your neck. Interested in knowing about more symptoms you should never ignore? Well, male and female bodies are built differently. Let's keep things going with a couple more health-related videos, shall we? Here's what you need to know. Check out 14 health symptoms women should never ignore. You can also try 14 health symptoms that men should never ignore. Go ahead, click one, or better yet watch both and learn more about health and wellness. Did you know about these symptoms before watching this video? Let us know in the comments below.